Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Sai Chiram Malayala. This video is uh, mainly for all the PWD candidates out there. Important and major step each and every PWD student should follow. If they don't follow this, their chances of getting into IIT, NIT or triple IIT, GFTI will be cancelled. They cannot proceed forward in this counselling process too. If you are not a PWD student, try to at least share this video to the students who know. Like you, you know right there will like your friends or friends of friends who are PWD candidates. Please share them this particular video because it is one of the important video for all of them. So if you see this uh, from last year, there was no uh, physical verification for PWD candidates too due to the situation. So due to that, uh, some issues happened. So that is the reason to overcome those issues. This year, they have kept that every PWD student should visit nearby reporting center. I mean IIT or NIT nearby IIT and NIT. So there are also some rules in it. I will be discussing as we move forward. They said that they should go to that particular thing and they should verify all the documents which are required for their eligibility. So PWD candidates take a look over it. So let me show you the important things from it. Excel batch for dropper JE mains and advanced 2022 is starting from 28th October. These are all the faculty who are on the right and these are they are topmost faculty from South India who teaches you in English. So this is totally an English batch for droppers. And this is one of the Hindi batch for droppers where uh, you can see the faculty over uh, below. And uh, this batch is also starting from 20th October for same JE mains and advanced 2022 droppers. This link is also in the description. If you want to enroll for any of these batches, so the link is the links are in the description. And if you use my code CharanYT, you will get instant 10% discount on all subscriptions of an academy. And the Unacademy Mega Combat for IIDJE is back. On October 17th, 11 a.m., you will be having this test. 60 minutes, 21 questions, and you can win a chance of winning 10 crore worth scholarship. Just for participating, they are going to give you 15% off on all subscriptions of Unacademy. You can enroll now for this particular test using the link in the description and my code CharanYT. Follow me on Unacademy profile so that whenever I take a class, you will get a notification on strategy sessions, math sessions which I take. Physical verification for PWD candidates only for IITs. So there won't be much difference, just I will say. So those who wanted to, like those who are going, those who are qualified in JE Advance, they should go to nearby IIT are required to visit any of the IIT physical verification along with a copy of PWD certificates. I will be showing see physical verification process start from 16th October and continue till the counseling rounds of JOSA 2021 and uh, each qualified are required to complete this process latest by end of the counseling. So if you are, if you got seat in round one by the end of round one counseling. So before round two re release of uh, seat allotment, there will be one last day before you need to complete each and everything like document upload, fee payment and all right. So before that you need to complete everything. So if uh, a PWD candidate first got seat allotment in third round, before the allotment of fourth round, last date will be there after allotment some time will be given right. So before that date, you should complete the verification, a PWD candidate should complete the physical verification. Before candidates come for physical verification, they are required to register on JOSA portal. You need to register on JOSA portal. So JOSA portal is in the today's morning has, I have shown you how to do how you should do the registration and how to fill the choices right in that uh, dashboard itself. After registering, you will be having an option to register for this particular. I mean booking the slot for physical verification where you need to choose any one IIT which is near to you and also you need to choose uh, date as well as forenoon or afternoon which uh, uh, like you are going in the morning or in the afternoon so that link will be available on josa 2021 portal before coming for physical verification so what are all the dates uh, one can choose one uh, there are two intervals either here or either here one is first during 10 days from 16th to 25th october either during these days or during the counseling time after allotment you can go or else before uh, uh, like uh, closing of choice filling 16 to 25 or uh, I said right if you allotted in third round before allotment of fourth round you should go in, in between there will be some gap like uh, three to four days in these days or these days you need to complete the verification and it is candidates responsibility to plan the travel so it's up to you you should plan everything related to travel and all JOSA is not responsible for anything okay so now comes to NID plus system which includes those who qualify those who didn't qualify JE advance they just qualified JE mains and wanted to get into NIT, triple IT and GFTA. So they also need to follow each and every step same thing which I said till now only thing is they need to choose near NIT nearby NIT. 
So those who qualified in advance, they should choose nearby IIT. So those who qualified in JEE mains and wanted to get into NIT, Triple IIT, GFTI, they should go nearby NIT. So they should also register which NIT, which date, which time, I mean morning or afternoon. Everything they have to register and each and every uh, proof for their PWD category, they should carry along with them and get it verified at before 16th, so these are the 16th to 25th or before during the rounds during the rounds we can say what is during the rounds so if you are if you're getting seat in the second round of counseling um, so there will be gap between second round and third round of counseling right i mean third allotment and second allotment gap will be there during which you need to complete your pay payment and everything right so during this time so you should complete the verification either during this time either during this time any uh, like you should okay, it's up to you which time you wanted to go so at that time you should complete your verification uh, so this is one of the most important step for all the pwd candidates please make sure you complete the verification process that's it guys if you find this is a time worth the video please do like share and subscribe see you in the next one until then take care bye bye jai hind